which is underserved as far as substance use Incredibly. needs go, but you are in there with an organization, Reality Check, that yes. is doing some work there. So tell me about what you are doing yes. to make life better for other people with issues around your area here. Awesome. Yeah, so I'm the Director of Prevention Services at Reality Check, and so I oversee everything prevention related. I have the distinct pleasure of going into three separate school districts that we serve. Which are? We have the Messinic Regional School District, yeah. the Jaffrey Rins School District, and the, I can never say it correctly, the Conval School District, which is, I believe, Kentucket Valley, <laughs> if I'm saying that correctly. Works for me. But the Conval School District yeah. as well. And so we work anywhere from elementary school, middle school, through high school. And I get to go in. We play Jeopardy sometimes as far as making healthy decisions go, if that's what's appropriate for the age group all the way to talking about how substances can impact your mental health mm. and how mental health can impact your substance mm, use. Right? You know, it's really important to talk about that transverse yeah. kind of effect there. But it's so much fun. Well, and it's just such a beautiful full circle for you. It really to is. To be able to go right back to kids around mm -hmm. your age and yeah. give the help that, that you would have liked to have probably right. at that point too. And prevention. Like, it's a win-win-win. Right. It really is. And I, I love doing it. And if I can talk to a seventh grader that potentially had a similar experience that I did where right. they just had their first panic attack and they don't know what to make of it, yeah. maybe I can make a safe space for them. Maybe yeah. that classroom, they feel heard that day. Maybe that's the one class period that they don't leave that day. Mm. And that's, yeah. that's all I can hope.